Hi, my name is Ed Meyer, president of Meyer Industries, manufacturer of the Roadnator line of pest control products. Here at Roadnator Worldwide, we very much thank you for your purchase from us, and we're going to show you how to use each individual product here today. All right, you've just had your Roadnator delivered to you, and you're ready to set it up and go use it. So you're going to notice that it comes in two boxes. One box is the smaller square box. That's going to be your accessories. That's going to house your hoses and your regulators and your safety hearing equipment. The other box is actually the Roadnator itself. So now we're going to unpack these boxes, show you what's in them, show you how to assemble them, and set your gases up and go out and actually use it. All right, you've just received your Roadnator R3 in the mail. You've unpackaged it, and you're ready to hook it up and go use it. Let's go through a quick checklist of what was inside to make sure you have everything you need to be operational. First thing is, is your hose. This is a T-grade fuel hose, not an acetylene hose. There is a difference. If you're not using our hose, make sure that you're using a T-grade fuel hose. You're going to need a fuel regulator to handle the propane, as well as an oxygen regulator to handle your oxygen. The regulators attach directly to one end of the hose, and the other end of the hose attaches directly to the Roadnator R3. This is in the long box with your 25-foot ignition cord, as well as your three-foot extension hose and your metal extension snout that hooks on to the end of the R Roadnator R3 or onto the end of the hose, as well as hearing protection. Sometimes it can be a little noisy. And in some places where you have burrowing uh, pocket gophers and moles, you'll be supplied with a Roadnator shovel. This is a really slick little tool for opening up holes that are closed by the animal. Okay, now we're going to put this all together and show you how to be operational with it, and then we're going to set our gas mixtures.